I'm Leslie Foster and we begin tonight in a way that has become a painful reality in our nation's capital. Our neighbors are being shot and killed, shattering lives and the peace in our community. I don't like talking about this, but we really have to because the gun violence is out of control. That shooting I just told you about hours after another shooting. Well, it was all between just a few blocks. So the one that happened near North Capitol and O Streets was in the Truxton Circle neighborhood and there police say someone shot five people and two of those victims died. Casey Nolan is staying on top of this investigation for us. He's live from police headquarters with what we're learning tonight. Casey. Leslie, where this all happened is central to both the investigation and the frustration from parents. Police say they know this area well, and parents say that is a problem considering how close this all happened to their kids' school. It shouldn't be this way, especially so close to the Capitol. So close to power, yet many feel helpless. I mean, of course, I, it worries me, but what can you do? People living near North Capitol and O Street Northwest say this scene Wednesday is too familiar. And I'm getting tired of walking everywhere I go and seeing a homicide team, man. Police say just before 1 o'clock, two shooters got out of this small black SUV and opened fire on a group of people, hitting five and killing two. They were either in chairs or standing. Investigators described the block as an open-air drug market that they are regularly patrolling. This is an ongoing problem for us, so we need the community's help to continue to quell the disturbance in this area. And those bullets could have flown anyway, in any direction. It all happened just outside Jude Collins' daughter's elementary school just as they were about to get out of class. I could have been walking up the street with my daughter, literally just holding her hand, going to the car. The school delayed dismissal. We were actually packing up when my teacher, um, when my teacher heard the, the shots. Um, so we, so we pretty much had to get under the table for a little bit. And no children were hurt, although parents worry about wounds they can't see. No way in the world on my daughter's first day of school she's supposed to hear gunshot firings and a murder occurring within 30 yards of her. That's absurd. I'm, this is unbelievable. And the kids will likely remember this. In fact, today they were just telling us about another shooting near their school that they remember from last year. As for this case, no suspects have been named as of yet. Police Leslie are just looking for that SUV. We talked about that black SUV. I tell you, you hate that the lessons they're having to learn have to do with ducking under a desk uh, as school is just beginning. Casey, thank you.